Hi guys, so today's video is going to be on a review of the Naked Palette Number no. 3 by Urban Decay. No, I did not get sponsored. I waited in line just like everyone else. What a surprise. And I bought it full price just like everyone else. Um, this was $62 um, at Sephora. Okay, so here it is. The packaging is super, super cute. At first, I didn't really care for the Naked 3 like I saw online and swatches and stuff. I'm just like, ugh. Gosh, what's new this time? But when I saw it in real life without like intending to purchase it, I actually went to buy uh, the NARS palette, the blush palette, and I saw this and I swatched the colors, and the colors are so, so divine. You guys, it's so pretty. So here's a close up of the palette. Um, I love the color, it looks like a giant chocolate bar, and I just want to eat it. But um, I love the texture in here, it just feels so good. It feels like a dreamy chocolate bar, like honestly. See, so open it, and it comes with a mirror and a brush, a two-sided brush. So here's a closer look. I do have some favorites. This one's my favorite um, highlighting um, as of today. I also like the Black Heart, this one here. It's just a pretty, pretty color. Um, I also like Limit. Um, as a crease color and this is really pretty also Nooner and factory so I'm wearing a couple of these colors on my lids right now but I feel like I can't wear it alone like I have to use other palettes in different colors on my lids with this so it's not convenient for me I do like a palette that has everything in it like you know the black and just everything I need in one palette but this I don't think it does give me the completed look that I want. So if you're the type of person that's like, I need everything in one palette, this palette is not for you. Um, it definitely has some rose gold tone um, shadows, so it's just mainly that. Overall, the color payoff is amazing. It's super high pigmented. So it's super pigmented, as you can see. It's so pretty. Oh my goodness, this color's black heart. So let me swatch a color for you guys. I'm going to swatch Factory just to show you guys what it looks like on my hand. See, it's super high pigmented. It's very gorgeous. So here's the color Factory. It's so pretty with one swipe with no effort. So this one is Black Heart, one of my favorite ones. It's a black with like pink shimmer in it. So I did wear some of these colors on my lids this morning um, as I was getting ready. Um, I used Strange, which is the first one, as a highlight. And then I used Limit as a crease shadow. And then I went in uh, to darken the uh, the outer V with Factory and Blackheart and also under here. It has stayed on. I've applied my makeup at like 6 in the morning and I still have it on. I believe it's like 3. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see it, but I'm not going to go too close, you know. It's kind of like all day makeup kind of thing. Also, a lot of people have been wondering like what it comes with because the first one came with the uh, primer potion. The second one came with a lip gloss. What does this come with? It comes with a little sample um, of their four primers for the eyeshadow, for the lids. So it comes with four of their primers, um, low pods, so you can just take them out like that. And they have some pods here with different colors. I believe they have the original one, the Eden, the Sin, and for the anti-aging one. So uh, you get four little deluxe samples or just samples in general. So they do have three matte colors. It's Strange, Limit, and Nooner. The rest, oh my freaking goodness. I just dug up my nail into a black heart. Look at that. Did I just ruin my palette on camera? Oh my god. You guys. <laughs> I'm like actually really sad. Guys. Oh, I'm sad. Meh, meh, meh. As I was saying, they have three matte colors and the rest are shimmery, glittery. Um, I absolutely love this palette. J'adore, j'adore, j'adore. Did I do that again? Oh my god. I'm, I'm gonna close it before I ruin this palette. Ugh. So overall, I really, really like this palette. It's really great for your collection. The colors are truly divine, um, super unique, and it stays on all day long. High pigmentation. The packaging is gorgeous. I honestly wish the first um, Naked was packaged like this because I will show you why. Like, it starts fading. It looks disgusting. Like, it's just so, like, 
you know that feeling where like lint gets stuck onto it like it's just so dirty and ugh. and I believe it's like fading too so I'm not very happy I think they should make um, like reinvent the naked palette number one and make it like this package so it won't like you know get all linty and dirty and rubbing off uh, I would definitely repurchase it if they did repackage it but yeah so yeah that's my review on the palette if you're debating to get it or not if you are a collector and you love to collect makeup, you definitely need to have this in your kit um, or in your collection. But if you're someone that is practical and needs something that they can use every single day, then this might wouldn't be for you. But if you're a makeup lover, a makeup junkie like me, you definitely, definitely need it. Seriously, get out there and buy it ASAP. It's so gorgeous, you need to do it. If you have the one or two ready, might as well get the three just to complete your collection, right? My hair is very staticky right now and it's really creeping me out because I feel like there's some paranormal activity going on, like some presence of some evilness in here and I feel like someone's breathing on me right now. It's freaking me out. But thank you for watching. If you guys have any more comments, let me know. I will see you guys later. Bye. Mwah. So, as promised, I would read mail. So I have four mail here, which I don't think a lot of people are sending me mail right now. So what's going on, you guys? Please, please write to me. I want to hear from you. Um, but let's open this one first here. I believe it's from International Post Australia. So let's open it up. I'm super, super excited. Oh, that's cute. Hi, Julie. All the best for Christmas and the new year. Spike. Thank you, Spike. Thanks for the Christmas card. I love it. You're so cute. So this one's from Kyle Erickson. So, aw, little cute little kitty. Aw, thanks, Kyle Erickson. You drew me a little, little puppy. Like a homemade card. I love that. Merry Christmas and happy holidays, Julie. Hope this holiday season, New Year, find you happy, safe, and prosperous. Your Facebook friend, Kyle E. Aw, that's super sweet. Thanks, Kyle. All right, so this one's from Gloria Chang. Little candy cane back there. Let's open it and see what we got. Like, that is so cute. Merry Christmas. Hi, Julie, Princess Jewels. I just want to wish you a very Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. I love watching your videos and I hope you'll do more makeup tutorials in the future. <laughs> Take care, Gloria. P.S. I hope you like this card. I made it. You made this card? Oh my god. Gloria, you're so talented. I love it. Thank you. All right, last but not least, from Wayne. Let's open this. I'm telling you, you gotta send me mail and I can read that online for y'all. Hey, Wayne, you did a very good job licking at this envelope because seriously, this is like shut tight. Okay, we got this. I'm like a horrible mail opener, you guys. Like, I just cannot do it. Ugh. Oh, that's a cute card too. Merry Christmas from a big grizzly bear. All my love to you, Wayne. That's very cute, Wayne. You also gave me a little card here. Let's see what it, whoa, girl. Holy moly moly. Dear Julie, about a month ago after discovering you and your videos on YouTube, I sent you this message, but you probably did not read it. I wanted to send it to you again with this card and wish you a very Merry Christmas. I also hope you have a wonderful new year. I think you're an absolutely fascinating person, sweet, bright, and beautiful, with so much to give and teach the world. I envy your friends, Wayne. Aw, that's very sweet. Thanks, guys. Oh my god, you guys just donated to my, like, ego jar, and I'm so happy. This really means so much to me. Thanks for sending me cards. I love you guys so much. Mwah!